Yeah, I have a 10 year old girl and uh, I, she would obviously love to do this. I remember I checked right away when I heard about you guys yeah. and it was like, it was great because it was like, why don't you teach the class? That's what the Code Club website says. Right. It's kind of like, all right, there's not one in your school, but there's one here. You could start one here kind of thing. Right. But I'm curious, what would she be learning like the first day and then like the fifth week? Mm -hmm. Like if she walks in at 10, like what kind of thing would things would they be doing? Would it be stuff that's like kind of browser related like web or would it be separate code just to give people an idea? Yeah. Um, so on her first day, she would um, probably do a project that introduced her to a program called Scratch. Um, and Scratch is, um, is software that was developed by MIT specifically to teach kids the, um, the basics of coding without them having to write any syntax. Um, so that, you know, when you don't get syntax errors, you're just dragging and dropping blocks together um, okay. that create actions. Um, so you can make games um, and animations and stuff. And you get like this immediate visual feedback, um, which the kids absolutely love. Um, it's an amazing program. It's really powerful. Um, and so we'd be like walking her through the interface of that. Um, and then she would be making um, a mouse, a cat follow a mouse and stuff um, just to get used to it. Um, in, within uh, eight weeks, she'd be designing and building her own game in Scratch, um, having learned a lot. <laughs> it moves quite quickly. Um, and then, say, another... 10 weeks later, she'd have done more Scratch, but then she'd be moving on to uh, HTML and CSS, and she'd probably be building her first static web page by then. Um, and then another eight weeks later, um, she'd be starting to learn Python. Okay. Yeah. Which is much more of a logic based. Yeah. So then, so, so the, the logic behind it was that um, with HTML and CSS, they could be like writing syntax without it being too hard going. Okay. Um, and then they would get into Python, and obviously that's. Uh, that's a bit more, a bit more hard. Okay. That's pretty cool when they can actually design a website. I mean, 